Today I'm going to share with you how I make one of my smoothies. This smoothie is basically a, a kind of a, every little bit of this, every little bit of that, <laughs> but not really. It has mango, as you can see, mango, pineapple, and I'm going to go put two pieces of watermelon in there. And I am going to add to that my other ingredients which is uh, peanut butter, some oats, and I'm going to use the base, the liquid, as milk because I'm trying to get my toddler to drink more milk. Um, he doesn't drink much, but he needs to. I'm trying to get him to drink a little, a little bit more here and there. So I try to put it in different things so that he'll be able to, you know, have some of the benefits of drinking the whole milk. Uh, so that is my start right there. And also I forgot one other surprise ingredient that he doesn't know. I mean, he doesn't know the rest of it. All he knows is it tastes good. All he knows is that the smoothie tastes good. And one ingredient that I add in this is some carrots okay so I added the carrots so now we have mangoes pineapple watermelon and carrots and I'm going to add now my other ingredients which is the oat, oats uh, oats the milk peanut butter my surprise Peanut butter, not really a surprise, but peanut butter. And I'm also going to add yogurt, the plain yogurt, plain, no uh, flavor yogurt. Nothing fancy with the oats, just regular cooking minute oats. And nothing fancy with the peanut butter either, just regular, uh, well, this one is all natural peanut butter. So it, you can see it has a little oil floating on the top. It's the all natural one. But um, I use different peanut butter if we have it uh, in the house. We always have peanut butter, but it's different ones that we have. So whatever I have at the time, that's what I will use. So I'm actually going to add, this is a tablespoon. Tablespoon, one tablespoon, two tablespoon. I added three tablespoons. You can add as much or as little as you like. I like the thickness. Let me add a little more. I like the thickness because it's kind of it's a little more hearty. It's a little more hearty, and um, you know I, I know that he'll get full. Um, so I added the oats, and I'm going to add now the yogurt and the peanut butter and the milk. So this is the yogurt, just whole yogurt, plain. Um, that's what, you know, I use. That's what I have. I'm going to put just one spoon. It's one spoon of that. Sometimes I put a spoon and a half. There you go. Okay, added my yogurt and I'm going to add my peanut butter. I also added some milk too. Oops, sorry. There, I add my peanut butter. Let me. Okay, I added my milk, add all my ingredients. So I'm going to put the cover on and I'm going to blend. Make sure you seal it tight. You don't want your liquid to come out the sides while you're blending. It has happened to me before. <laughs> Not fun, but I caught it in the early stages, um, which was good. So I'm going to blend this now and come back and sh show you how it looks. And... I wish I can have you guys taste it, but you 
can make it and tell me how it tastes. Yeah. See that? Has a bright orange hue to it, of course. You know, my sticky ingredient carrots. <laughs> uh, if you guys try this, please comment below. I do check my comments. So drop me a comment and tell me what's your favorite smoothie? Which one would you like me to make or try to make? All right. And also with this smoothie, if you are going to serve it right away and it's not Sometimes when you um, pulse it, it will get a little warm because the blades are, you know, it's so hot spinning. You can add ice to it to make it cool. Usually, um, I put it in the refrigerator for a little bit so that it gets cool. Um, but sometimes I do add ice if I'm going to serve it to him right away or, you know, drink it myself right away. So, let me know how you make your smoothies. All right? I actually have some other recipes too of smoothies that I make. I have those videos coming um, soon, so hit the subscribe button so that you'll know when those videos are posted so you can see the ingredients that I use and how I make those additional, those other smoothies. All right, so just remember hit that subscribe button and hit that bell button so you will be notified when I upload another smoothie video or any other of my any video any video okay I'm going to pulse it again and then I'll be done all done and I am going to pour it out in a cup now in my glass I'm going to pour it out in my glass there she is all done boom thank you guys for watching don't forget to hit that subscribe button <laughs> yummy, yummy.